Hello, today is Tuesday, August 25th, 2014. My name is London, and I'm here with you for your daily tarot reading. I picked three cards as usual from the Rider Waite tarot deck, and I also am going to pick a card from the Angel Therapy um, deck by Doreen Virtue. The first card that we have for Tuesday is the Seven of Pentacles. And the Seven of Pentacles is all about looking at your investments, looking at things that you've invested your time or money or whatever in, and just um, taking a look at it to see um, what you can do or um, how you may grow this um, project that you're working on or how you can expand. So um, for Tuesday morning, we may just be looking at um, different options as to what we can do to um, do for our projects and to expand or to um, to generate more money even. The second card that we have is the Justice card and it's all about cause and effect and balance. Um, this card is just basically letting us know that whatever effort that we put into our projects, our, um, we're going to get that same thing back from it. It's almost like the law of attraction. Whatever you um, put into something, you get back from something. So just know whatever we're investing in, if you choose to invest a lot or you're, you're really trying to make a decision as to if you should invest a lot or if you shouldn't maybe invest a lot, just know that whatever you choose, you're going to get back. The last card that we have is the um, six of um, wands, I'm sorry. <laughs> And this is one of my favorite cards. Um, the Six of Wands is all about people's um, celebrating you, celebrating you and your successes. So and this is just bas basically letting us know that whatever we invest in, we're going to get um, the effect of it. So if you choose to invest a lot, you'll get a lot back from it. If you choose to invest very little, you'll get very little back from it. But just know whatever you choose to do... Um, it's going to be successful for you. You're going to make the right decision. So um, good luck in making that decision, whatever it may be. And we're going to pick um, a card to sum up the reading. And I feel guided to this card. And it says, you are a powerful light worker. It says, it is safe for you to be powerful. Your spiritual power brings great blessings and loving service to the divine. And isn't that a beautiful card? As you can see, this angel is, she has a lot of, um, I think these are rosettes um, coming into her heart. And it's this beautiful white light that's shining out from her chest. And it's a very beautiful card. And we're going to read a little bit um, from the book just to find out what um, more information about this card. Okay, and we're back, and it says, This car comes to you because the angels want to help you feel more comfortable with your spiritual power. You are extremely powerful because you, like everyone else, were made in the image and likeness of your powerful creator. Divine power flows through you when you hold the intention to conduct a healing or give a reading. And it says, it is safe for you to feel and channel this power as it is not a, not a personal or ego-driven force. When you intend to use your divine power in service of love, you experience harmony in all of your activities. The more comfortable you are with your spiritual power, the more steadily and evenly it flows through you. And it says, action steps. Tightness in your stomach muscles means that you're experiencing a power struggle. You either feel that someone is trying to control you or you're confused about how to use your power. The next time you notice this tightening sensation, say, Archangel Michael, please help me. Please help me step into my divine power with grace and gratitude. Notice your stomach muscles relaxing in response to, to this invocation. As well as the situation easing easing into a win-win solution. And that's a beautiful card because 
um, whatever you're investing in right now, just know that um, you're going to get what you deserve out of it. And you're going to be very successful. And this is what this card is letting us know. You are a powerful light worker. And just know that you're going to get whatever you um, you invest into something back. So um, keep that in mind if that's what you're going through right now. And I hope that this reading resonates with you. And as always, I will keep you in my prayers. God bless you.